right, so tell us your name and where you're from. My name is Annie and I'm from Portland, but I live here in Tri-Cities. All right, and so tell us your story of how you came about to our church. Um, well, my friend Maria, she's over there, um, she started going uh, a little bit before I did and she invited me and I kept saying, no, I'm good. But then one day I just came and decided to come. Okay, and so when you first came here the first time, what was your experience and what did you think? Well, I've gone to other churches before and they were good, but I was like, it's okay if I don't come back. But when I came here, I was like, whoa, this place is awesome. <laughs> and I was like, I'm definitely coming back. <laughs> that, that is awesome. Okay, and so after you started coming, what, when and how did you come to the decision to give your life to Christ? So I started coming about two months ago, and I remember I had a conversation with Sylvia after home group one day, and I was like, Sylvia, it's so weird, but my heart keeps burning. Is this normal? And she was like, well, have you given your life to Jesus Christ? And I'm like, well, I, I, a long time ago, but then I stopped going to church, and then she's like, well, you should do it, and then next Wednesday I did it. Awesome. That is awesome. So how long did it take you? So how many times did you come before you gave your life to Christ? I did it on the fourth week. And why did it take you so long? Because Ilya just brought them up on the stage, and I'm like, I don't want that much attention. <laughs> I was like, I'm shy. <laughs> and so on the fourth time, what made you finally give in? Mostly the conversation with Sylvia, and then Vlad was here, and he brought him down here, not up there. <laughs> so I'm like, I can do that. <laughs> <laughs> no. Okay, and so since you gave your life to Jesus Christ, ever since then, what changes or how is your life now? Well, before, um, happy hour was my favorite thing to do. So I would do happy hour on Fridays. I would go out, stuff like that, hanging out with the wrong people. My roommates were not good people. So then I started going to church, and I'm I've gone every Wednesday, go to home group every Sunday. I don't go out anymore, <laughs> things like that. That is awesome. And so ever since then, what are your goals now with the vision of our church? And what are your goals in your life now? My goals is to um, have a stronger connection with God, Jesus Christ. And I've also wanted, always wanted to do mission trips. So maybe do something like that in the future. That is wonderful. And so, last question. What would be your advice to people? Maybe it's their first time here, second time here, and they're scared that they're going to get pulled on the stage, and maybe their heart is burning. What would your advice be to them? Just do it. Um, if I could go back, I'd do it the first day, too. But. That is awesome. You guys, let's give a round of applause for her and to God. Thank you so much, Annie.